Thank you for visiting West Coast Auto Enthusiast. Today we're featuring a 2006 Porsche Cayman S. This is a single owner, clean title, clean Carfax car. It's got 58,000 miles on it. Had a really nice MSRP of uh, 72 grand, which I think was 13 grand uh, in optional equipment above the um, $59,000 base MSRP. Um, so if you're not familiar with these, they've been a, a big hit. Uh, it's, a lot of times it's people's entry into the Porsche market from other um, uh, manufacturers, especially from BMW. So a great handling car. This Porsche, is, it's a mid-engine car, so this is the hard top and the Boxster is the soft top. And um, they're really, really uh, nice driving cars because of the mid-engine. Uh, if you're not familiar with them, the, they've got two trims. They've got a base and a S. And the base has a smaller engine, it's a 2.9 liter. Uh, the S has got a 3.4 liter. Uh, it's got uh, 30 uh, more horse, the S has 30 more horsepower, 30 more pounds foot of torque. And then the uh, base comes with a five speed and the S comes with a six speed. That has made a big difference in the purchasing um, for whatever uh, reason, most people want the S. Um, so we're, we're, we're targeting those typically, but if we can find a base that's low mileage and really clean, we'll buy that also, uh, especially in the manual transmission. So this is a clean car. Uh, we would like the equipment on it. If you haven't driven one, it's definitely worth a, um, uh, a try. This and the Macan have really, I think, I don't know if they've made um, Porsche enthusiasts out of non-Porsche people, but they have certainly taken a lot of people out of BMW, Mercedes, Audis, other stuff, um, and put them into uh, Caymans or Macans. Um, they've done a really good job. So buy, uh, buy Xenons for this car, that's an optional piece. Uh, I've got premium package on it, you've got heated seats. There's your door trim. Yeah, you've got an upgraded stereo, so that's both surround sound. You've got dual power seats. Uh, let me undo that. So, see the back is clean. I've got pictures of all that stuff. Um, we do have two keys, uh, two sets of keys, which are here. Uh, and then we do have a set of books. So, super nice. We took the uh, carpets out. So we do have the mats. They're just out because uh, from our detail, the carpet was wet. And if we leave it in there, it doesn't dry out. So I'll start this. Again, you're probably familiar, but Porsche's ignition is on the left. I'm gonna roll up both windows. There we go. So passenger side door is clean. Passenger side seat is clean. Dash is clean. Turn some lights on here. So center console, a little wear here, some marks here. So Tiptronic transmission, which is automatic. That's manual mode. Uh, and then you have paddles on the, the um, steering wheel. So climate control, heated seats, defrost, and then a very basic um, media interface. So you have navigation, you have, um, I don't think you have Bluetooth. Uh, so it's basically satellite radio, AM, FM radio, navigation, uh, really, really basic interface. So the newer generation is totally different. And uh, you know, my guess is like we had customers that bought these when they were new and they didn't have radios put them in because they wanted to listen to their engine. That's the Porsche world for you. Um, you have cup holders up here. Not sure how functional functional those are, but they both work. Um, kind of an unusual design, but the Germans, I think, are annoyed they have to put cup holders in cars and so make them so they almost guaranteed not to last. You've got cruise control. Um, pretty straightforward. Fifty-eight thousand eight hundred one miles. There's no codes or lights. While the surface is current, the other thing we liked about this car was. Um, it was only Porsche dealer serviced and it has been serviced regularly. Anytime you can find a Porsche, um, if you're in the Porsche market, you're going to see that a lot of them will have five, six owners. 
that's not necessarily a bad thing in the Porsche world because a lot of people buy and sell them and they move to something else, but anytime you can find a single owner Porsche anything, uh, it's definitely an advantage because, and with a lot of cars, especially the performance stuff, uh, your first uh, owner is always takes the best care of stuff and there's typically not deferred maintenance. So anyways, if you have questions or would like additional information, please feel free to contact us. We can be reached at 503 227 2354 and thank you for visiting West Coast Auto Enthusiasts.